we usually don't remember our early years of life. But our early childhood experiences can affect our physical, mental, behavioral and emotional well-being in later stages of life and also continue to influence us well into adulthood. Hello, I am Dr. Pooja Kapoor and I am a pediatric neurologist. Today, I am going to discuss about early childhood learning which includes gross motor, fine motor and other development domains. Scientists have discovered babies only hour old are able to differentiate between sounds from the native language and a foreign language. The study indicates that babies begin observing languages while they are still in the womb. So, early childhood education starts from the time mother conceives. There are four developmental domains in early childhood education, which includes the physical development, cognitive development, socio-emotional development, and language development. And all of these four domains are equally important in early childhood education. So let's start with the first one, the physical development. It includes the growth, movement, fine motor skills and gross motor skills. So from quicking and squirming to holding of objects, crawling, standing, running, the development of fine and gross motor skills starts in early years. Fine motor skills refers to use of small muscle groups, which includes hand, wrist, fingers, feet and toes. Gross motor skills are to do with large muscle groups, including the coordination of arms, legs and other large body parts. It includes movement like walking, running, jogging and hopping. Second is cognitive development. So cognitive developments include your thought process, your academics, your memory, your retention of the things, your decision making and basically your intelligence or your mind. Third is social emotional development. It includes your interpersonal and intrapersonal relationship, how you do with your relationships, your communication skills, your self-management and the self-control of yours on your emotion. The next and the fourth is the language development. It includes letter knowledge, sound knowledge, reading, speaking, writing, listening language and also your expression, be it verbal or non-verbal, in which you communicate yourself to the other person. At childhood, we have a variety of activities designed to promote child's cognitive and social development, mental and emotional development, which are the essential building blocks of a child's future success. Parents, Today, are constantly concerned about their child's development. Are they learning enough? Do they have enough vocabulary as their friend? Isn't she or he late in reaching their milestones? How do you know that your child is on the right track? And what could you do to ensure that they reach their true potential?